Good morning, everyone. We're on our way to Cars and Coffee. I haven't been to this one before, but the theme this month is German cars. So, if you're new here, I'm Chris, and this is Pia's Projects.
I need to get my trailer ready for uh, to help a buddy haul a vehicle. I'll go pick it up. I wish I had the winch on the trailer. I have one, I just haven't set it up yet. So that's gonna have to happen probably sooner than later. I need a brake controller added and I need to swap out at least two tires, maybe all four. I have all four. I just need to, <laughs> two of them will be white wheels or white rims and uh, the other will be black steelies. So I'll just put the whites on one side, blackest on the other. But yeah, let's do this brake controller. So first thing you need to, um, this right here comes off. All right. This comes off. I have this harness. Uh, it should plug in. I think it's up top. <sighs> yep. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and connect it to the uh, brake controller. So I have the Prodigy P3. Uh, I've used the P2 in two other trucks, three other trucks. I just basically keep using it. Uh, this is just the upgraded version. Nope. Comes on. Or drive forward hit the brakes make sure it locks up and uh, then I'll mount it up permanently so it works um, I just need to find a spot honestly I'm either gonna put it right here because that's typically how I run it right there clean up the hose brake line or I could put I don't really want it there All right, wiring's all cleaned up. Now let's swap some tires. I know y'all seen this in the corner for a little bit. Um, I may have mentioned what it was. Race ramps. This way I get a longer approach with the trailer when loading up uh, vehicles, in particular the bug, but also the car we're picking up uh, tomorrow for my buddy. Well, I'm heading down to help my buddy pick up a car trailer is all sorted I has, has four new tires on it uh, yes one side is uh, black steelies the other is white steelies but 
all new tires. One has, I think one set of tires might have like a thousand miles on it. It's, yeah, but they're all basically brand new. Uh, the tires I took off, oof. yeah, I'm glad I, uh, I'm glad I looked at them before uh, picking up the Beetle. Which is not what we're doing today, just to clarify. This is more of like a dry run, or a test run, I guess. Um, I also, those, uh, if you remember before, I uh, got lights working on the trailer. Yeah, that, that's actually pretty big. They're sort of a hodgepodge together, just because I ran out of connectors. Well, not ran out, couldn't find enough connectors. I know I have more. I just, and I was on time crunch, so that's fine. Um, I have, as you saw, I opened up the race ramps. I have them loaded, so we'll use them to get, uh, help get the car loaded on as well. Check back in as we uh, move further along. This always cracks me up. Well, you know, when you can see the rain coming, you know what you're going to drive into, but you can't really do anything about it. Trailer's back in the backyard. Truck is unloaded. Uh, I have the straps. Ramps, everything drying out. It's been a wet day. <laughs> wet day. Brake controller worked well. New tires on the uh, trailer definitely work well. And thankful um, that I have the lights working. Productive weekend. Saw an awesome shop. Um, I should have asked if I could have recorded, but I was more so like a kid in a candy store. Just in awe. So many. So it's a Mustang shop, okay? So many variations of the Mustang there. Um, you know, Fox body, 60s, 90s, even uh, late model ones. And yeah, wild. But uh, I appreciate everyone tuning in. And uh, this upcoming week, Helen Prep. So, back to working on the uh, Joker. Go out there, be helpful, work on your projects. Don't forget, there's always a solution.